So after you've launched your program and connected your device, you just have to click on this first tab here, and you can see it displays my device, and then all of the file types I can recover. So let's go ahead and select a few we want to recover. We'll look for audio and videos, and let's do some documents too. So then we'll click on next. And then we have two options. We can scan for just deleted files, which is a very quick process, but sometimes that doesn't find very hard and deleted files. So you can also select scan for all files, which takes a lot longer, but looks much deeper. In this case, I'm just gonna do scan for deleted files and click on next. Now it's going to analyze my device and prepare to scan it. All right, and then it's going to scan my device once it's finished analyzing it. And this time will vary depending on how many file types you've selected and how much data is actually on your device. All right, and now that the scan is complete, we can go in and go through and find the files we want to recover. And we can actually preview most of the media. If we had pictures, we could see them. We can see everything, basically. To recover any of these files, we just have to select it and then click on Recover. And then we'll select the file location and click on Recover. And now all of those files will be saved onto our computer, backed up. That is it for this tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed. That is how you use the Android Data Recovery feature. In